Hey guys, welcome back to episode 18 of uh, Derby Dreams Career Mode. Um, <clears throat> sorry, I'm choking on something. I've just woke up from a nap because uh, I'm quite sad. Obviously, you'll probably all have heard by the time this episode goes up. But Derby took a right spanking today. We've just lost 4-0 to Aston Villa. So, I've kind of had, like... I do apologise for yawning. <sighs> I've just gone and had like a comfort mat, a comfort map, a comfort nap, just to try and perk my spirits up because I feel terrible. Um, obviously, when you, you don't feel good when your team loses, but to go four 0 down at half in the first half, it's just absolutely abysmal. I just don't know what to say. And then you're in again. I do apologise. I've had a, a drink of energy drink, and I think that's what's choking me to death. Or it might be the bag of um, sweet and sour Harry Bow sweets that I've just eaten. Whatever it is, something's choking me. But anyway, right, hopefully, 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 the last episode we ended up drawing two games. Um, hopefully, I can, I can win because. It's getting really tight. With four games to go, three, six, there's 12 points altogether. So obviously, first place is pretty much out of position. Um, so it's either going to be second place or somewhere in the playoffs because if Norwich win their next game, they'll shoot up ahead of me. Uh, if West Brom win their game, we'll be drawing our points. But I still have the goal difference ahead of me, but it's not looking good. I mean, look how many goals Stoke has scored as well. So it's everything to play for now in these last four games. So I don't think I'm going to start change swapping squads. I'm going to start using this squad as much as I can. Because um, obviously I need Jack Marriott to start scoring goals because obviously he's about the only one I can rely on. But I'm going to start rotating out tired players like... I think Mason Mount's a bit tired and thorn, so I'm going to rotate them two out. Um, and I'm going to bring on Junior, wherever he is. Where are you, Junior? There you are. So I'm going to play Junior in that position there. And I'm going to take off Keo and swap him with Mount. And I'm also going to bring on. Uh, I think it might. Can you play CDM? No. You know what? I might move him in place to Scott uh, Carson. Can Lawrence play CDM? No, Lawrence can play left wing. What about Wilson? Right, you know what? I'm going to go back to how it was before. So I'm going to put Lawrence back up here. Wilson there. Uh, Junior is just a camera right, a right wing. Marriott's a right wing. Where's he from? Netherlands. Interesting. Uh, sorry, that will do, I think. Uh, da, 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 unless, can the Holmes play? No. McCarran? Oh, McCarran can. You know what? I'm going to give McCarran a go here. See how this does. So, hopefully, with Junior and Wilson supporting Marriott. Karen holding the back four up and then Zoom and Lawrence just running down the wing. It might work out in my favour. Hopefully some magic will kick this episode off. What a ball to Wilson, what a knock on, what a shot. Oh my god! What? What a freaking goal. I am telling you, Wilson's left foot is beautiful. Oh, look at that, that was... Look at that run, that little knock on, and that just left footed shot. Freaking hell, that was beautiful. I want to sign him. I do not care. I he if I get promoted, a lot of my money is gonna go on that young man because he is freaking excellent. Four. Eight goals, get in there, lad. Oh, okay guys, so I've won that one one nil. 
Um, I know it's only one gold, but I do not care. But what a bloody goal it was. Let me show you it again. Look at this. Right, there's Harry Wilson. Look at him running. One knock on. And boom. Left foot shot straight over um, David. Is it David Marshall? I think it is. He stood, he didn't stand a chance of saving that. Look at that, it's perfectly dipping and everything. And what can I say? That left foot of Harry Wilson is beautiful. And thanks to that, that has hopefully taken us into a second position, hopefully. It looks like we've played a game in hand as well. Um, so we'll see. Right, let's have a look. Da -da 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 drum roll, yes. Look at that, so we're drawing with Villa. So did Villa win or did they draw? Okay, so Stoke City have won the championship. That's fine. Obviously, there's no way we're gonna have to worry about that now. I'm gonna praise Derby after that performance. Or I should have praised Harry Wilson personally. Uh, so, all to play for now is pretty much second place. So what, there's six, nine points left to play, so I could loan off of a horn. Do I want, to? I'm going to loan horn out, I think. What rating is he? 56, yeah, I'm going to accept that. Hopefully it'll go through, because there's been another update for FIFA. Um, so hopefully they've sorted out this loan deal thing out. Right, this is it. So again, I'm going to play with, with this squad, because I'm going to play them in the pink. I'm quite happy with this squad. The, I'm going to make a few changes. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to swap out Harry Wilson. But, can John play up here? Where are you, John? Damn, Junior's knackered as well. I'm sure John can play. Yeah, John can play left wing. So we'll move John up to here. And then I've got Mount in. I'm going to swap Malone to Forsyth. Wisdom for. I'm going to give Quigora a go, I think. And then Zoo. I'm going to play. I'm going to take a chance on Bennett on that right hand side. And then I'm going to swap for now. But Lawrence. play at homes instead I think and then on the bench we'll swap you two around uh, uh, and I'm gonna bring on Maya instead of Keo I think so hopefully we'll see how this squad goes I don't know whether to swap to rest Nelson this game yeah I'm gonna rest Nelson for I can find a sound clip. For Sandler, I think. Yeah, sorry. We'll see how this squad goes. Right, that's the ball to Bennett. I like Bennett on the, the win. Oh, look at that for a turn. Look at that for a pass. Oh, Mason Matt. No, no my God. Oh, I need to take a second. Oh my god, that, that, oh what, to, I don't even, I'm lost for words, I can't even talk. That was it, I mean, look at this, this was a lovely, first of all, it starts with uh, Holmes doing a lovely three ball to Bennett, look at Bennett making that run, that's a lovely ball through to him, and then he stops, turns, passes it to, who is that? I don't know who that is, is it Holmes again? Okay, he does another three ball to Look at that, tight three ball to Mason Mount, who's got plenty of space just to gently tap it. All he has to do is tap it into that right, can I move the camera around? Literally, oh, look at all that space that he's got right there. All he has to do is side foot it into the back of the net. And what's he going to do? Right at the keeper. Okay, maybe not, but oh my days, so much power on that shot. I honestly could. That is gutting. Right. Oh, it's a throw in the fourth in the corner. Right, ref, come on. That's that's two minutes gone. If they score now. Oh my god, that is ridiculous. That's well over two minutes. 
That is freaking just no. Oh. Would be easy as well, wouldn't it? 45. More like freaking 49. Oh, quick, what's my right back to it? He's found Chong. Chong! Chong's done it. You run to your assist. Where's he running? He, he, I don't know where he's running to. But, oh my God. What a goal. What a play up. Set up. I don't even know what I'm saying. Oh, I'm just so relieved to freaking score that because I'm still in with a chance. But that was a lovely chip by whoever it was. And then Quigora, I think it was Holmes, who chipped it through to Quigora. He managed to pass that through to Chunk, who literally threw his right, his left foot at that ball then, didn't he? Oh my God, this is stressful. Right, Forsyth has seen what Quigora to do, and he wants to do it now. But instead, he's going to pass to Mount. I don't know what Mount's doing, but he's found Thorne. He's found Maya, who scores! I'm sure that was his first touch of the game. First, yeah, first touch of the game. And he's bloody scored here. What a beautiful. And that all started from Forsyth. So, credit where credit's due. That was a lovely run. Man managed to hold that. Passed it to, uh, don't know who that is. And then Maya just kicked that straight in the back. And then, oh, it's George Thorne. Okay. That was lovely. Look at that. Another left footed goal. Keep had no chance again. Right, so Maya. He's seen Bennett break. Oh, Bennett. Joe! 3-1. Oh! What a lovely goal right towards the end of the game. Oh, bloody Nora. I'll tell you what. I'm not going to lie. I'm really holding my breath every time I get up into that end in case I miss. I scuff it up and miss. But luckily... This team, man, it's really working for me this episode. That was a lovely set of play, lovely ball, and then a lovely left footed kick again from Chunks, who scored two in this game. You beautiful, beautiful man, nine goals. At least there's one thing I can say that's good about this team this season. I can get goals from pretty much everywhere. So it's not just relying on like one striker. My midfielders, my wingers, even my defenders are shooting and scoring. Another one! Oh my god, how many corners do you want to give them, ref? Just blow this bloody whistle, please. Chong. Thank you. Oh, okay, guys. So, after being 1 0 down, I managed to make the most epic of comebacks and win that 1 1 0. 3 1. Oh, that Quigora has got man of the match, but uh, to me, Mason Bennett played really well in that game. I really like playing him on. The right hand side so I, I think because before I started this episode I was thinking of selling him but I think I'm gonna um, just leave him on that right hand side and bloody Villa won again <coughs> that is really close for, thir for um, third and second you know one slip up and I'm gone it's really stressful I'm not gonna lie right so our valley Avili has gone up, Ortiz has gone up. No one else has really gone up. Um, <sighs> press conference. Again, I'm praising Derby after that game. There's nothing else I can do apart from praise them. This episode, they've really shown spirit. <laughs> it's all up to me now. Hornslow, why? Why has it been rejected? Fine. Okay, that's fine. Brr. Right. Okay, guys. I'm going to end this episode here. Um, I don't know if I'm going to play this next episode now or I might leave it for a bit because honestly, it's very stressful. I'm literally holding my breath through every game in case I screw up because as you can see, if we go back to the table, freaking Villa are chewing on my feet. On my bum, literally. Who are they playing, actually? Uh, so we're playing Bristol City. They're playing Leeds. And who are Norwich playing? Blackburn. Okay. Where are Leeds? Oh, 
MT, oh dear. I really need Leeds to win that game or a draw and then I need to win. Or we can both lose it or we can both draw. As long as we each match whatever, then I'll be happy about Bloody hell, Stoke are catching up with goals for us now. Look at that. We're only six goals ahead and they've conceded less. Um, <laughs> it's so nerve wracking. Right, anyway guys, I'm going to end this episode here. Uh, so thank you very much for watching. I do hope you have all enjoyed it. And I'll see you in the next episode for the nail-biting finale. Will we get promoted or will it be playoffs? Come back to the next episode and find out. See you later. Bye.